Hey and welcome back to Cruising Kisma. We're Sophie and Josh and we live on a narrow boat on the Loch Iron called Kisma. So in this video we're going to show you an official boat tour, we're going to share all the features that we love and just share a little bit about ourselves and a bit about the boat. <laughs> built in 2010. It's 60 foot long and 6 foot wide and she weighs about 20 tons. So we bought Kisma in August 2021 and she's been our full time home ever since, both on grid and off grid. So guys, when you enter the boat, immediately to your right we have our wood burning stove. During the winter time, we will burn coal and sticks they say to keep us warm. It is in the very right front of the boat, which is not the best in my opinion because other narrow boats will have it in the middle, distributing heat. So that's why we have these little heat fans that will push the air through the boat. So our living area is one of our favourite parts of the boat. We spend most of our time here and this is a great sofa here because it's actually a futon so it falls out into a double bed. So we have a guest over and it's quite comfortable. So our living area is shared with our kitchen area and then we have this lovely breakfast bar to split the two in between. We use that for dining, for preparing food and also for working on as well. As you can see, we have a gas hob here, uh, our liquid safe kettle. For my favorite feature of the boat is this massive spice rack, which you can't get open. There you go, it holds absolutely everything. On to the rest of the kitchen, we have our big bathroom sink, which is great for hiding dishes you don't want to do. And of course, the drain the board full of dishes that have been done. Uh, behind me, you have your oven and grill. Uh, and the fridge below here, the small freezer compartment. We recently got a new washing machine, as the old one Game of Ghost, uh, which is basically working great. So this is our bathroom area, we also have a toilet and a shower as well. This is our sink area, and um, we also have just our little bits and bobs, toiletries and things, and plenty of storage space underneath the sink, which is so, so good. So our shower is fantastic, there's so much space. I think that an arbor is going to be quite small and compact, but we have plenty of bathroom space here to spread. This is one thing that a lot of people do ask about, is our toilet. We have a composting toilet here, and it's nice to have a little door as it separates everything, and you can have your privacy. <laughs> Welcome to the master bedroom. As you can see, I'm lying on the bed. You can just about fit in. I'm 5'11". If you've been any taller, you literally wouldn't be able to lie across this. This bed does fold up and you walk walk sort of through it, but the other narrow boots have beds long ways instead of across the ways. We also have a big wardrobe, uh, which is great. There used to be doors in this, we did take them off, so for easier access. From the bedroom, you then go into the engine room. As you can see here, it's a small space, mostly for storage, but under here, is our engine. So we hope you enjoyed our narrowboat tour and all the little features on the boat. If you haven't already, drop us a like and leave a comment down in the comment section below and uh, don't forget to subscribe. Thanks, Thanks for watching! watching.